For the most part, I'm going to be talking about CSGO, which is the current iteration of Counter-Strike. Though some of these points will also apply to 1.6 and Source, though we are not covering Source games at the moment. CSGO is a tight, claustrophobic shooter where terrorists and counter-terrorists fight for objectives, last man standing, and occasionally gun game status. Let me not sugarcoat this review. I am not good at Counter-Strike. Any of them. But I still have a ton of hours logged into each of them because even though I will never be pro or even amateur or even decent at this game, I still have a ton of fun with it. These matches are intense, they rely on absolute focus, twitch reflexes, and knowledge as to how each of the guns work and the regular habits that people make when using these guns. Regardless of how typical guns work in real life, there is a defined expectation that the op, the deagle, the AK, and other signature guns of this series leave as an impact on you. The game is a lot of fun and there is an intensely high threshold for skill in going pro, so if that is your intention, be sure to study this game, because everyone else has been studying Counter-Strike for nearly a decade at this point. There are a ton of updates and the crates fiasco is an ongoing thing, so there are elements of cosmetic gambling if that's your thing. Otherwise, it is an annoying notification that will linger in the background forever. Additionally, there are seasonal events that you need to buy about every three months, but since the cost of the game itself is $15, it's not really a big deal in terms of investments. There isn't a lot of closed door content and there certainly isn't a need to go after it unless you're a completionist, in which case it is indeed worth it. Overall, it'll end up being one of those games you end up owning regardless. There's always a friend who is super intent on playing it, and I jump in for a round about every month or so. It's a ton of fun and a staple of your inventory, and chances are it's a staple of the community you're a part of as well. 